As Taylor Swift marks the end of a chapter with her latest album, she's turning the page to a happier story. After releasing the Tortured Poets Department, the Grammy Award winner, 34, gave a glimpse at her romance with boyfriend Travis Kelce while kicking off the hashtag for a Fortnite challenge. In one clip from the YouTube Shorts post, which was set to the lead single, Swift could be seen cooking on a stove as Kelce, 34, kissed her on the cheek. Another snippet showed the lovebirds sweetly holding hands as they visited Gardens of the Bay in Singapore. In March, the singer notably stopped by the country for her era's tour stop, with Kels also joining his girlfriend. The pair could be seen gazing up at the supertree grove that was brightly lit up at night. She also included a behind-the-scenes photo of herself with Ethan Hawke on the set of the Fortnite video, which she dropped earlier Friday night. Other clips featured Swift working out, partying on a boat, hanging with her cats, and recording her album. Swift was first romantically linked to the Kansas City Chiefs tight end last summer, before confirming their romance at a game in September. In anticipation of TPD, Swifties found apparent nods to Kels in the lyrics, as well as exes Joe Alwyn and Maddie Healy. The 15th track, titled The Alchemy, immediately stuck out to fans, thanks to some obvious football references. Cheers chanting cause they said, there was no chance, trying to be the greatest in the league, where's the trophy? Divided by he just comes running over to me, she sings. Touchdown, call the amateurs and cut them from the team, Swift continues in the chorus. Ditch the clowns, get the crown, baby I'm the one to beat, cause the sign on your heart said it's still reserved for me, honestly. Who are we to fight the alchemy? Swift previously released a statement about how the album signifies her moving on from a sensational and sorrowful time in her life. Following her six-year relationship with Alwyn, 33, and brief fling with Healy, 35, this period of the author's life is now over, the chapter closed and boarded up. There is nothing to avenge, no scores to settle once wounds have healed, she wrote. And upon further reflection, a good number of them turned out to be self-inflicted, added Swift. This writer is of the firm belief that our tears become holy in the form of ink on a page. Once we have spoken our saddest story, we can be free of it. And then all that's left behind is the tortured poetry. Swift also released the Fortnite video on Friday, featuring collaborator Post Malone and several apparent nods to her past relationships. The TPD release comes amid a two-month break from Swift's record-smashing Eras tour, which resumes May 9th in France.